This is a Triple Helix tech tip. This year, Triple Helix was one of the beta testing teams for Rev Robotics' new Max Swerve modules. We have an important lesson learned that we wanted to share with the rest of the community. We discovered when we were doing our first tests that one of our modules ended up sounding kind of crunchy compared to the other ones which sound nice and smooth and we traced the problem down to some gear teeth that were damaged in this swerve module. The reason those gear teeth were damaged was that we had some metal shavings that got into these gear teeth. You can see that these gear teeth are greased. When we drilled out these tubes, the metal shavings got to, on the inside of the tubing, and then we assembled the frame and greased up the gears, and then if this drive train gets tilted, all of those metal shavings slide down the tube directly into the gears in the gearboxes. And some of these gear modules, you can see little shavings that are still in there um, because it's not all cleared out yet. So we wanted to let everybody know that if you do use these swerve drive modules and you use this kind of tube construction, you want to 3D print or make some sort of cap for these tubes so that when you drill into them during the season, when you're mounting things on your drive rails, all of the shavings that are inside of this tube either fall out other holes or stay in that tube. You do not want those shavings coming out of your tubes and going into your gears.